Assalamualaikum viewers. This is my channel Mind Blowing, and today I'm gonna discuss the summary of the novel that is Devil on Cross. So this particular novel is written by the Nagogi Ba uh, Thiongo. So let's discuss about the characters of the novel. Uh, the first character to whom we may say that or we are uh, able to say uh, she is the protagonist of the novel. The entire novel is written around her character. She, in the beginning she is a, a very weak girl like uh, most of the girls and she attempts to suicide several times but at the end she is developed into a uh, she improves herself and she is a strong girl a strong woman uh, now there is the second character the devil's feast guest so it is not a single character but a group of the characters uh, like uh, all the borgies criminals uh, and colonizers who are invited to a, this particular feast those all are named as the devil feast guests uh, after that there are the rich old man from Negorica. so this particular rich old man um, is the person who was once having the affair with the Waringa and uh, he also impregnated her, pregnanted her uh, and when she got pregnant he left him in the deep water and never looked back uh, on her. Uh, after that there is the Robin Mavira he is the taxi driver who runs the taxi and he is having the ideas uh, he idolize, idolizes the rich people and then there is the Matori. Matori is a person who works in the industries different companies to earn her living uh, his living and uh, he is also fired by the uh, boss uh, Kihara that is the way, uh, same boss of the uh, uh, Waringa also so they both are fired from the job then there is the Wangari. Wangari is a peasant girl who is from a, a village and uh, she has come to the city due to some reason and now she is going back and uh, after that she is also the guest at uh, she is also invited to attend the devil's feast uh, devil's feast uh, uh, invitation she, is, uh, she has also received. Uh, Gatoria is uh, actually a student who is learning the music and he is also having the interest in the history of the Africa and he is a quite decent and gentleman. Then there is the uh, uh, Mavirari Wa um, Mo, Moki Rai. Uh, this particular person is a businessman or we may say that he is a Borji and he is also invited at the Devil's Feast. Uh, then there is the devil he is an allegorical figure whoever uh, means involved in some kind of the crime that can be claimed as the devil over here then there is the boss kihara boss kihara is the uh, is the boss of the uh, Waringa where uh, and he is the uh, ceo of the company or the owner of the company where she works and uh, he also offers her to be her sugar girl but when she refuses uh, he fires her from the job then there is the John Kimwana. He is the boyfriend of the uh, Waringa, and uh, he is quite a uh, good person. He is uh, a university student, but uh, he uh, leaves Waringa uh, because he uh, did not trust her that she could ever to refuse her boss offer. So that's why their relationship ends. Then there is the Jack and uh, uh, J Candy player. Jack Candy player is actually the narrator of the story and uh, narrator of the story and he is uh, narrating the uh, entire story and uh, uh, whatever uh, events are being discussed in the novel that are due to his uh, uh, due to him and he's telling us the entire novel so in the first chapter we are uh, uh, this the novel starts with the explanation of the of a girl the music is played and she is going to take her life she is going to attempt the suicide and uh, in uh, and there is uh, uh, this particular discussion we find in the chapter one then there is the chapter two in the chapter two the narrator introduces us to the protagonist protagonist is actually Jakinda Waringa and uh, she is the protagonist of the novel and uh, she is uh, uh, if we talk about her past so once she had a uh, affair uh, an affair with an old rich man from uh, no, uh, no uh, Nagorica and uh, he, this particular man was was very much older than her 
and he also impregnated her impregnated her and when she was pregnant he left her in the deep water with the baby and he never looked back on her uh, to her and um, this is uh, how their their uh, affair ends and after that uh, after having the um, baby uh, varinga attends the school and she continues her study studies and after uh, that uh, she earns to get a job at uh, the construction uh, champion construction company but soon she is again the victim of uh, her boss uh, boss uh, advances and her boss name is kihara he uh, offers her to be her sugar girl but she refuses that particular offer because she has also um, gone through a, tra a traumatic lifestyle due to these affairs so she are now she don't want to have such type of affair and she refuses her diligently and after that when she refuses her so he fires her from the job and she is left uh, as unemployed she directly uh, go um, she directly after being fired from the job she directly uh, went to her uh, boyfriend that is uh, kimwana and she uh, told the entire story to her to, of the, her boss to her boyfriend but he n did not believe on her that uh, she could ever to refuse such type of offer of her boss that uh, means he did not trust her and this is how the his her relationship with her boyfriend is also uh, also ends and uh, now uh, she is not having any money to pay her rent where of the apartment where she is living so her all the things all the belongings are thrown on the uh, road and uh, she's left with nothing and she's quite disappointed because lots of the problems she's facing at the very same time now let's move to the next slide and see what's there to explain uh, so uh, uh, Varinka is having uh, is left with no option so she moves to the railway track to take her life means it's her uh, means she's moving to the track uh, to take her life in the first chapter the girl who is introduced to us to take her life uh, to uh, she is attempting the suicide uh, this is the very same girl uh, we were talking about in this uh, first chapter Baringa. Uh, she was going to attempt the um, attempt the suicide and uh, uh, she was uh, also prevented uh, by a person uh, person um, Monty uh, was his name and uh, he uh, con persuaded her he convinced her that she should not take her life and he also handed uh, her uh, a card an invitation to the devil's feast uh, devil's feast when she looked at that card so she found the invitation to the devil's feast and the address is very uh, very much similar uh, very much known to her because it's the address of her hometown so after this she uh, means she is prohibited from uh, she is not uh, she uh, means uh, uh, she is not willing to die she is not willing to kill herself now she moves to her uh, she uh, is trying to move to her hometown so on the way uh, she gets a taxi and uh, in the taxi there are the four other passengers also and to whom she meets one of these passenger is uh, passenger is uh, uh, passenger name is katoria he's a student um, he's a student uh, of the music and he's also professor of the african studies he's a gentleman and after that there is a woman a woman also that is named as the wangari she is a peasant woman uh, who has come from a village area or rural area we may say that then there is the Matori uh, Matori is actually uh, an, uh, uh, an employee at an uh, industry or we may say that at a company uh, company and he is also fired from the very same company from which the wearing guys fired so they both are the victim of the same boss the behavior boss kihara's behavior because that is the name of the boss uh, after that there is the mavi uh, mavi rari uh, 
uh, Wa uh, Moki Rai. So he is a businessman who is also invited to the um, to the devil feast and uh, uh, the driver name. There is another person also in the uh, in the taxi and he is the driver of the taxi. Uh, that is named as the Mavira. Mavira is uh, a person who wants uh, uh, who wants the money, and uh, he also idolizes the rich people. Uh, rich people to uh, to he also wants their company. So after uh, they are on their way, all of them are discussing about the devil's feast and their invitation. They all are common, uh, common in a way or in a sense that all are uh, all have received the invitation to the devil's feast. So uh, they all uh, means decides that they will uh, go there and uh, attend this particular uh, feast because uh, that is uh, um, that is also encouraged. They all are encouraged by the uh, businessman Mavi uh, Mavi Rari that the devil feast will be the competition where all the criminals, colonizers, borgies of the uh, borgies will come. And the place or the address is also quite very much accessible for the Waringa as that is her hometown, uh, El Morog. So that is quite accessible to her. So they will in the devil feast is it is also told to them by the uh, mavi uh, by the businessman uh, mavi rari that uh, uh, there will be the competition between the robbers that who is the most cleverest and most uh, richest and wealthiest uh, among them all and seven most cleverest uh, robbers and thieves will be chosen from the in this feast and uh, it is not uh, uh, it will not be the uh, feast that will be limited to the uh, local people and local robbers and thieves but uh, it will also include the uh, robbers and the colonizers from the america england uh, germany france italy sweden and japan uh, so they all will be there secondly he also mentions that it will be organized by the uh, organization of modern theft and uh, the robbery so these all things uh, interests all the passengers in the taxi uh, and uh, uh, and encourages them to attend this particular feast so in the uh, so they all uh, went to the feast and uh, Waringa and other passengers uh, uh, all are sitting in the feast and all are watching that what's happening in the feast so uh, every robber every colonizer every borgi come on the stage and explain how he is earning their money and how he is becoming wealthy they also talks about their personal wealth their wives their girlfriends sugar girls and so on and so forth everyone is boosting and uh, uh, after that uh, um, everyone is boosting and uh, the then there uh, comes the turn of the um, Mavi uh, Mavi Rari and he's also one of those businessmen so he also puts the idea his idea is a little bit different from all the other Borgies criminals and uh, robbers thieves and uh, uh, what we may say colonizers of the feast his idea is a little different that uh, he should uh, uh, that uh, uh, they should not provide the chance means the Kenyan people should not provide the chances for the international people or the foreigners to uh, take their wealth from their country uh, in fact their own robbers their own local robbers and thieves should be provided with the chances to uh, to earn the money to get the money from the people to snatch the things from the people uh, and the other foreigners should uh, not to uh, be encouraged to enter their country for the purpose of uh, taking the wealth from the country so this particular thing displeases many of the um, guests of the um, uh, devil feast and uh, um, so um, the mavi uh, mavi rari uh, this particular um, businessman is also um, murdered by the mavira who was the taxi driver and he's uh, given the target to kill him so at the end of the novel he's killed by him uh, killed by him so the feast is going on and uh, everyone is boosting every every robber is having a chance to come on the stage and boost about his wealth 
and his uh, girlfriends and so on and so forth Varinga and Katori are quietly sitting and uh, looking at them and observing each and everything while the Wangari and Matori they both uh, um, they both heads to uh, take some steps Wangari went to the police to ask uh, ask these uh, to ask the police to arrest these uh, uh, criminals criminals and Matori went to gather some peasants workers local uh, people and citizens students from the universities together and uh, uh, means to take the revenge from these thieves and robbers uh, so uh, they went there and while the uh, this particular feast is going on and during this uh, particular feast uh, Wangari and Katoria they both went for uh, having uh, for uh, lunch break and in that particular lunch break Wangari discusses her past life with the Gatori Gatoria and uh, they both having uh, they both started a close relationship with each other from this particular point because Gatoria is not having any uh, any means problem with her past if she is the mother of a child it's not a problem for the Gatoria and this is how the, they both are engaged in uh, some kind of the relationship uh, and their nature is quite relevant to each other so after this they came back to the um, this particular feast and uh, over there they saw that Matori uh, um, the Varenka has uh, uh, come with the police and but the police did not uh, arrest those uh, uh, criminals but instead they are dragging the uh, Wangari uh, to the police station and they have arrested her and uh, Matori also uh, means rises the mob of the local workers to that particular uh, address of the devil feast due to that the robbers thieves and criminals all are scattered and they run, uh, and they run away so um, run away and again the Matori with the, the local workers students and, and peasants is arrested by the police and uh, uh, arrested by the police at the time of the arrest Matori handed a uh, uh, gun to the uh, Varinga while he is uh, being dragged by the uh, police so uh, the time has passed it uh, the devil feast had ended and it's been two years uh, and uh, the Wangari is uh, uh, Varinga sorry is engaged to the Vato, uh, to the Gatoria and uh, they both are having a close relationship uh, and uh, Gatoria and Varinga is also means uh, uh, moving forth in her life she has earned uh, she has become uh, an engineer also and uh, now uh, the Gatoria has also finished her musical classes and uh, now uh, they both are able to marry each other uh, Varinga is uh, Varinga's old uh, Varinga also comes to uh, Varinga is having a good life she is uh, working as an engineer at a, a workshop at a workshop of the uh, of the automobiles and during this time uh, she uh, she is informed about that a person has owned this particular workshop and he's willing to build a hotel a tourist host hotel at that site so she is no more uh, able to work over there so uh, th and she also come to know that that uh, this particular person is her old uh, boss Kihara the person who has already fired her from the construction uh, company that's very same person is gonna build a hotel on the site means hotel uh, on the site he's gonna build to earn more money he is willing to earn more money from this so after that uh, Gatoria, uh, Gatoria uh, is actually uh, willing to uh, marry uh, Varinga so uh, Varinga uh, he once told to the Varinga to get ready so Varinga is uh, um, Varinga wore the nas her national dress and she is looking quite beautiful she went to uh, visit her uh, Gatoria's parents and when she uh, went to her home she saw most of the robbers most of the thieves Borgis in his home in Gatoria's home and she's quite su surprised and when she when she uh, went to meet her mother uh, she uh, gave her many blessings but when she uh, saw his father so that was the very same old um, old man old rich man who has impregnated her 
and uh, impregnated her and uh, this is how she also understand that why there is the similarity between her uh, daughter's features and uh, gatoria's features because the father is same of the both of these uh, these uh, people so this is how uh, she is quite stunned uh, she is quite uh, astonished surprised and uh, other than this this particular person the old rich man uh, the uh, now uh, she come to know that is gatoria's father so uh, she is uh, quite astonished she is standing uh, uh, like a statue and at that time this particular person the old uh, rich man is not uh, uh, having the peace he is continuously means uh, uh, advancing uh, advancing on her and uh, advancing on her and uh, so uh, she is uh, um, so fortunately or we may say that luckily she was having the gun that uh, matori uh, gave her uh, on the devil feast when he was about to be arrested so she uh, um, i mean pick up pick up picked up that uh, uh, gun and fired uh, the old rich man and gatoria was left in surprise that uh, to which party he should uh, support he should take the um, side of his father or his uh, or his future wife uh, but he's left in the um, surprise and before that uh, uh, before shooting this particular rich old man uh, varenka was also requested by the rich old man uh, in the lonely state that uh, he should she should not marry her to his uh, son gatoria because she is just like her his mother so uh, at that time she shoot to the uh, gatoria's father the rich old man and uh, after that uh, she went back to her home and she is not aware to where she should start and uh, uh, this is how the story or we may say that the novel ends so now uh, thank you so much it was uh, really very difficult task to uh, explain it in the english but i have done so uh, don't forget to like share and subscribe thank you